working as intended. But we had the materials for it, so why the fuck not? Bitch, it's Dur raining. Bitch, it's gonna be nighttime. Nah, it's gonna be raining blazes. Raining rice. Actually, that would hurt. Yeah, it would. So you know that gigantic ball of energy? Hey, it is night time. Time to sleep. Big ball of energy decided to make a second one. <laughs> oh, jeez. How much does this have in it now? Check 65 billion. Drum. I mean, you can only hold like 32, right? 32 what? You could only hold 32 in these tanks total, right? Or 64? Or is it just 32? Is it 16 each? Uh, those should be... I think the total is 32. And the drums are all full? No. The drums aren't full. But that's why that's I put this... That's slow. Set. That's because the refineries aren't fast. It's not like the super refinery you can make with immersive engineering, but it's one of those multi-block structures. That... It's cooler than that? Yeah, but on, that would multi-block is amazing. Yeah, but uh, I wanted to make my flamethrower now. This one has 40 billion RF. I'm wondering how I'm going to do the format of this energy obelisk. So I'm definitely going to have more of these balls of energy. Do you need more of them? Probably not, but they look cool, so I'm gonna make more. Of them. I'll also make more solar panels. Oh, I can tell you started making more solar panels because they pulled all the icons out again.
It's like six is the magic number. Then I have to interconnect these. All right. Let's see about trying out that uh, immersive engineering stuff. I'll make All right, what am I going to do? What's that? I'm going to try playing with witchery. <laughs> well, there's a bunch of stuff set up in my basement. Go ahead. Just kidding. Not yet. Ooh, I'm going to get this uh, another worth though. On that note, I should open up my basement. It's probably getting quite fumy in there. Yeah, another wart. You know what's weird? What's that? So another wart just grows on soul sand, right? Yeah. There are these things called crop sticks where you can put them down for pretty much any plant and then once it's grown you just right click it and it gets rid of the uh, plant and brings it back down to the first stage okay. without you having to like replant the seeds which is really really nice however if you do it for another one reason it requires darkness <laughs> and I don't know why Oh, I think I forgot to turn off rubber in the extractor. Let me find out. Yep, I did. Do we have like 10 billion rubber now? We have 2.4 million. Probably drained all the energy out of the uh, western... Oh no, energy's full. <laughs> okay. Alright, now I need to work on... I need to work on the mass fabricator. What do you build on top of a nuclear reactor? All of the machines that you want to test. Yes, exactly. Dumbass. I have plenty of RF. But I think EU I don't have quite as much. I just have it storing super storaged up so in case I use a bunch. This thing's suddenly using a lot of energy. It's not like I can't support that, but. I, could take, I think I've got to take out Wither World. Take out Wither World. Put that away. Well, I'm at 148,000 RF per tick being used. What's used? What's using it? Oh, it's probably the computer working at it. <laughs> This computer is probably an energy hog. But making those solar panels. Alrighty. So I gotta make a fermenter first so I can make ethanol. Then you put Sugar cane into the ethanol maker. Well, we, we have uh, 807k sugar cane, so I think we're good for sugar cane. Yeah, that's why I picked uh, the fermenter because there's also the squeezer where you just take seeds. But mm. 
You know you can stash that armor away and just wear your uh, draconic for now. <laughs> you don't care, do you? No. Well, don't blame me if you're accidentally killed by my AOE when I'm killing enemies around well, here. Well, at least at least it will be, you know, I'll, my corpse will be here. <laughs> Not in the lava <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> So I recall making a mass fabricator. Yeah, there it is. And a replicator. And pattern storage. What else is there? Scanner, that's what it was. All right. Got a mass fabricator. That's probably using up all the energy. So leave her to shut that down. Now to make engineering magic. Well, I think this thing already used up 200, 235 million EU. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's how it works. So, replicator. Much silicon dioxide. Not much. How to make silicon dioxide? Thermal centrifuge with clay dust. Where's the thermal centrifuge? Work at it. Making dioxide shit. I wonder if I should also make a thing going to a thermal centrifuge. I mean, I don't think I use this enough to to matter. 
Maybe if they give it more uh, upgrades. It's not working that bad. Decreases the process time to 4%. <laughs> you your percentages. It's math. This stuff and that stuff. All right, crystal memory. Oh yeah, grind some obsidian. Mass raider. Raw crystal memory becomes crystal memory when I put it in the furnace. Rhodium shards used for oh, compressor, okay. Might as well compress some. Alrighty, fermenter's working. Is there enough sugar cane for it? I I don't know. I just said there's like 800k sugar cane. <laughs> no, I already grabbed a bunch. Oh, hello, fermenter. Makes ethanol fast. Now I gotta go make... Uh, wait, I got everything here. It looks like it's consuming, like, all of it at a time. How much does it process at a time? Because if it processes more... Hang on, let me do something here. I need to make more jumps. It doesn't look like it goes through all of the time. It looks like it goes through nine at a time. <laughs> yeah, nine even, at a time. You can't even tell that. Uh, Can you the, upgrade the this thing? Filled? No, because they're white <laughs> with ethanol. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're slightly grayer. There's a slight color difference. I put upgrades in the thing here, so I put all the uh, sugarcane into it quickly. Wait, I gotta actually change these out. Oh, 
comes to more sugar cane in the chest. I gotta lift these drums up one. I'm gonna go make some more drums first. Hey. <laughs> Because I gotta put into these drums, and then I gotta take out of. I actually I don't even have to put into these drums. I don't. Uh, I sh gotta take all this ethanol out now. Scanner. Because I gotta pump the ethanol straight into the biodiesel thing that I gotta make now. Upgrades. I have to double check to make sure I ever, ever, ever finish the upgrades here. You know what's cool about the ranged, the wireless thing as well? What's that? I can do the auto crafting from distance too. Oh, jeez. So I need to make more drums first. These look like they're all upgraded. They were not all upgraded. And I'm missing one, so that one's probably the one from Bape. My trusty electric wrench. Which is a lossless operation take. All right, wrench. There needs to be a better wrench. It's like, hurry on this wrench, you can use it once. Did you pick up the machine? Um, Metal I farmer? I don't see it in my inventory. I thought I did. Oh, yeah, there it is. I just appeared. Give me a second. Thank you. There, I'll just keep my magnet off for a bit. And I didn't see any icons being sucked up, so I two more solar panels. What? I'm lacking lead. 
You were led in the wrong direction. I only have 23,000 lead left. Looks like it's uh, time to harvest some lead. Let it go. No. Okay, I need to make some electrum. You can auto make electrum. Okay, I'll find it. How much electrum is there? No electrum. I just told it to make 5,000. Okay, I don't need that many. I know, but I'll be using a bunch in the future, so. May as well be prepared. Alright, where was missing metal farmer? Should be a missing compressor, too. Okay, steel, scaffolding, and sheet metal block. This one's cutting. What would happen if I suddenly wanted a lot of upgrades? That would be, I am missing a lot of shit. <laughs> Let's go up here, you done scanning? Alrighty, time to make a bio D or wait, a, a refinery. That's it. It refines ethanol straight into biodiesel. Let's not take upgrades. Guess not. Good transfer node not work. Wanna wanna see magic? Kinda, yeah. You can you can watch as I turn this block. What is this? This is a refinery. As of, wait, I gotta pick the right block. Just... Ooh, refinery. <laughs> okay, that's the on-off switch. Here's the power button. I gotta turn it around. Ah, it's true. It. I'll just move the power around.
I think we need daytime. Alright, my good old lossless wrench. Fill that up here. Transfer node doesn't work on mass fabricator. Good. Oh, there we go. Sometimes it's just really finicky about how it fits in. Oh, I do need to make a part to open you too. You need what? I, I need both ethanol and plant oil to make uh, biodiesel. Alright, you read my book. Okay, same thing. Hmm. 
Rip scrap. <laughs> now there's so much energy coming in, it goes fast. It also drains the shit out of everything. Because I have lots of power. Don't let it go to your head. <laughs> This thing's a huge drain. Alrighty. Mass fabricator is up and turned off because of this power drain. But in that experiment, I made six more iridium ore. Nice. Next thing I have to do solar panels. Get some flattened tin. So we'll rick roll that. Maybe rick roll some more. And toss all these in. Let's flatten some of those too. Toss those in. All right, now we're in business. Let's get some or what action going. What to do with all this ore?
Might as well sag mill you guys. All this ore is from when I left that, uh, what is it, Corian in the mining world? <laughs> Yellow right ore is better in Sagmel is extra Yellorium. Pulverizer is extra nothing. Looks like it's going in the Sagmel. There'd be lots of processing going on. Yeah, there is. Get some more tingets made. Hundred thousand RF for ticks for machines. How is Sludge Boiler doing? Still working quickly, yep. How about you? Yep. <laughs> Never put the elevators in here. Alright. I guess that's something I should have done. How is this working? Om nom nom trees. Five hundred and seventy one K rubber sapling. I think I, I can get rid of some. Not. I'm gonna recycle a bunch of them. I think that makes sense. Get some scrap to help out by reducing the uh I think it reduces the amount of energy you need for the stuff by like eighty percent. And that should be consuming some power over here. Luckily, there are many reserves of power. Yeah. Only like one or two, right? Yep. Is it close to being done with ten? Oh, all right, that was quick. 
when I said start working through tin ore, it's already gone through fifty thousand. It's done. It, there was only fifty thousand, like or forty five thousand tin ore. So. Here, this is a compressor, right? Here we have a dream dust. More energy crystals. Going to need some more iron plates. So we'll keep rolling that iron. I guess I could use a metal cutter. That would technically be faster, but no. <laughs> How much rubber this can consume? 8,600. All right, need copper cable. That is extruding, so this goes in here. Gonna need some more copper and get soon. How much crushed tin ore is left? 26k. That'll be done in like... I want to say a couple minutes? <laughs> Jeez. I need some more MGM dust. A lot more in their GM dust. It's like redstone, we're still good. We've still got 60 something million redstone left. I'm guessing, though, I'm eventually going to have to make a coal world. This goes in here. More energy crystal. <laughs> A lot more energy crystals. Need all this dust. And Christian's done. <laughs> so it had to work through about 90k. Now for the copper. 
So I saw 80k copper dust. So probably about uh, 5 or 10 minutes it'll be done. Done about 40k redstone ore as well. Yeah, we're at uh, about 64 and a half million redstone. So that'll last a while. Grinding up some more diamonds. There are more seeds. Do you have enough seeds? Um, I should. There's lots of different ones in here. I don't think it uh, cares what kind you put in. Make a wheat farm? All oh, this energy and dust. That's right, super fast compressor. Work through it. I wish, wish I knew how to send nine at a time to compressors in the other machine shop, I don't know how to do that, so... Alright, well, what else do we need? Copper cable. Extruding. Because you know what I'm doing? What's that? MFSU Autocraft 100. Start. Wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's a lot. Yup. But we had the materials for it, so why the fuck not? Induction smelter hasn't been used in ages. It's getting lonely. I just realized there was 10 storage cells just sitting inside there. I guess I better put them inside one of the drives. Probably set them to craft one time and then forgot about them. Yep. Guess I'll make it craft 10 more. Uh, we have the materials to make a hundred more, it's just that I don't have a computer strong enough to do that. That'll keep computer busy for a while. Because the 100 MFSUs are already done. That was quick. Let's dance, zombies! I'm gonna do, try something insane here. Uh, I'm gonna keep it nighttime. What do you want to charge today? Ha! Day! <laughs> no, you can go ahead and turn it today. Even if you said no, I was going to turn it today anyways. I was playing with my flamethrower. Go 
going through scrap boxes very quickly. Goblin scrap boxes. Nom nom scrap box. How badly am I draining the energy here? 32 million left in the MFSUs. Alright, gobble through like 20 stacks of scrap boxes, then I'll turn you off. So what are you doing with all that neat shit over there now? Well, now I should probably find a use for all this fuel, but uh, it was just to power my flamethrower. And then I got carried away. Made six more iridium more. I mean, you probably should have guessed that there wasn't much more to it than me just wanting to blow stuff up or light stuff on fire. Let's see uses for biodiesel. I'm gonna have to let my E recover soon. <laughs> well, I'm already done with the copper. I mean, I could fuel a diesel generator. Use power from my power station to keep the diesel generator going and then feed the power right back into the power generation station. <laughs> hmm. DC it again. Tried to do pattern shenanigans, and the game was just like, okay, no. I think you've had enough, sir. Alright, so regular solar panel needs generator, needs iron furnace, needs furnace. Let's do three furnace patterns. Right, so this one will probably share with other solar panel generator because I probably wouldn't make both kinds at the same time. Now, where did the solar panel one start? Not here, apparently. Oh, there they are. Are they in the upper ones? Fuck it, I'll start it over here. <laughs> Furnaces. Oh, 
All right. Then we need iron furnaces. Check my generator. Ah, I'm still in the positives. Turn my, uh, wait, I don't need to turn that up. Man, auto crafting is so great. What would we ever do without applied energistics? Suffer. Probably a lot more explosions. What does that have to do with explosions? I'd probably get bored trying to make everything by hand. <laughs> so you just make SDX and blow shit up? <laughs> Maybe. Okay, let's fill these treasure chests full of seeds and other whatnot. Why did I just get a ton of crystals? What type of crystals? I got like almost a full inventory of pure Certus Quartz. Oh, I know why. Because the auto crafting was trying. I have to stop this auto crafting. Because you had your magnet on, right? Yeah. Uh, the Certus, when I make Certus Quartz, it actually has to drop into the puddle. But oh. the magnet still pulls out. There, I just turned off my magnet. It doesn't need to be on right now anyways. I'll just do the that thing when it's uh when we're like not both playing. <laughs> All right, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, trying to make... Iron furnaces. That makes generators. And that should make solar panels. I'm sure there's, like, optimal ratios to put these in. But, I mean, screw that. Too much work. If I wanted to do that, I'd play Factorio. <laughs> right, advanced solar panels. Irradiated glass panes. Reinforced glass.
find something else to try and play with here. Irradiated uranium. And just in case I make three of those. Some reinforced glass. Make some of that. So let's make six. I guess I only need one of these patterns. I can go with this other glass one. What a glass hole. All right. Radiant reinforced plate. It's another iridium ore, right? Bar with induction smelter, yes. So how can I get some rich slag? Oh, if I send a bar of uranium ore. We have good amount of cinnabar, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's neat. What's up? If I didn't have the ability to fly, you should come check this out real quick over uh, by my uh, reactor. Hang on, I'll make it day first. Huh. In uh, factorial terms, we call this spaghetti. That's just because I didn't plan anything. As long as it works, it's fine. I just made the pipes work. <laughs> <laughs> But if I if I would have uh, played with it before, I would have known that this how the setup is and uh, set it up a little bit better. But I just kind of made it how I thought it might go. This plant oil is full. Put it over here. What's over here? We. How did you do that? A skyhook. Do you need something special to use it? Oh, well, I'll just fly. <laughs> well, that, 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 that's what I—that's what I meant. It's like, well, this is kind of redundant now, but it's kind of neat still.
I'm going to use the induction smell. Hasn't seen use in a while. Oh, that slag. Yeah, 30... F wow, lots of rich slag. All right, uh... Rich slag plus iridium... Searching. Is anyone there? Hello? Sensor? Cinnabar plus iridium. Many, many iridium ingots. So we're going to need. Are you making nano armor? No, I'm making uh, solar panels. They require iridium now. Oh. I should have a set of nano armor in here that I could probably upgrade to iridium armor. Although that. That would also still be cheating for our. Uh... Twilight yeah, and at least wait until I'm finished all the patterns for solar panels first. Because if you use them, if you use all of it, I can't actually make the patterns because there has to be at least one. Oh no, I'm not going to use it. Iridium iron plate. That's not used a lot, so I only need one pattern. Wait, I'm wearing the wrong boots. I need to make long fall boots again. You need to take high damage? No, but uh, it'll prevent that. three of these. All right, and then now I need scenario. Go and put some super protection on it. All right, scenario requires a million EU. Let's see how quickly see how quickly this finishes. One tick done. All right. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, it needs one million EU, I just put it in, it's just, like, done. Like, instantly. Make an iridium iron plate. Man, there's so much new auto crafting going to be doing done soon. I have to actually set up more uh, quarries for more materials. Alright, what was I making? Oh, yeah. I need one of these. Pattern for this. Fuck 
like, yeah, getting stuff done. And shit done. Advanced solar panel. One irradiant reinforced plate. Does it require two circuits? Feed more sugar cane into the thing, too. Advanced solar panel. All right, so I can make an advanced solar panel now. So that is what I shall do. Make one. Done. All right, hybrid solar panel. You should make one of the helmet ones. That way you're always making power. This is Zuli block. Those are done. Those are enriched scenarium. All right, this one's going to be a little more of a challenge. You know, remember I said I finished that one scenarium one in like one tick. Let's see how long it takes to make a bigger scenarium, which is nine million R uh, EU. All right, ready, go, and done. Okay, so hybrid solar panel. Need to go to the pattern terminal. We need one of those. And your radium reinforced plate. I think that's everything for it. Let's do 
that. Make an unrich scenario. We need a lapis block. That's easy. We need two radium plates, which is not as easy. Hybrid solar panel done. Alright, here's where it gets really intense. <laughs> like camping? Wait a minute, you don't even need an advanced solar panel? Or hybrid solar panels? You can go straight from advanced to ultimate? I'm sure all the preliminary mats I put in will still be needed, right? Yeah, in which scenario? The plates. Yep. Alright. So, what does this take? Hy Ultimate hybrid solar panel takes two of these, eight of these. That's fine. Two of the, two of these. Whoa! All right, sixteen iridium reinforced. Plate. So I need an entire, I need an entire stack of iridium ore to make one ultimate hybrid solar panel. I have half a stack. Red. What? I was standing by my fence, out uh, farming, and a uh, creeper showed up. Mm. Well, now you have something to fix. Yeah. I'll go turn it daytime real quick. I'm planting a bunch of stuff for seeds. The industrial hemp is one of the best. I'm making scrap boxes. How many saplings are left for rubber saplings? And it's still 90k left, it's gone to like 400,000. Recycler. That's enough with the rubber saplings. Wait for the next time. Alrighty. Before I enter the <laughs> before I enter, I will turn off my magnets. Should put a sign outside the front magnets off at the door. <laughs> Alright, made another ten storage cells. like infinite storage here if I get these all filled with storage cells. There's like never any way we'd ever fill any all of these up. So it makes eight sixty four five twelve I guess four thousand ninety six for quantum solar panels. Also takes like a hundred and I think two hundred and fifty six iridium more. Jeez.
So what we need is iridium ore. How is my power over here? Thirty one million for all of these. Well, it's going to be a while for it to fill up, so. This quantum generator is the creative mode version. Well then... We're going to need more power generation. <laughs> Ultimate hybrid. Are you using more power than you're actually making again? For EU, I am. For RF, no way. There's, it'll take a while to do that. Why don't you just use your RF to make EU? Because it's annoying and I already have. <laughs> Actually, I could with one more test rack here. I mean, all it would take was is a couple of my... Uh, heavy cables. Like, is there RF near where you want to want the EU? Yep, I'm already doing that with a bunch, so I'll just set up more wire. It's wire coil, right? Uh, you, you want wire high coil. voltage. Yeah, I've got some. Because you don't need that many, right? I could probably use, like, 12. I've got... Five made and twelve of the connectors made. So the connectors can it have maximum one thousand? It's one thousand twenty. No, four thousand ninety six RF, right? Uh, yes, the heavy. So the heavies have to be like if you want heavy, it has you can't go. Uh, uh, like you can't go between these three. You have to go one to one. Like heavy doesn't. Uh, see, I can go to that, but I can't go from this one to this one because there's a cable connected. So. For heavy power, you have to put it from one to the other. So you'd have like RF connected to your EU, and that would be as far as you want to put it. Well, it can it can stretch probably about this far. So come over here. 
Yeah, I just gotta put these up. Which way? West. To the next building. Oh, sorry, I was kinda of, I was going to the center where the big thingies are. <laughs> so you mean like this? <laughs> yep. Do you need a couple more? I mean if oh, wait, I'm gonna if I'm going to keep this thing constant, I probably need another 230 to 400 of these going. But I'm not going to build that many, so... And the reason why I have two going to each one is that each one of these is uh, 4096 RF, which makes 1024 EU. But uh, MFSUs can only output, output 2048 EU per tick. So it only takes, uh, if it takes in more than two, then it just ends up being more positive. And if it's two in to, uh, and one fiber out, then it's uh, net zero. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I have to probably set up more of these. Because eventually I'm going to replace these all with solar panels, right? This entire thing here can be replaced with one solar panel. Okay. But yeah, that's only like 12,000 RF per tick, and if I have my ma all my mass readers going, it's 40,000 RF per tick. Or EU. So when energy is being filled up over there, it uses 48,000 RF per tick. What plants are you growing in the plant thing? Sugarcane, cactus, and rubber wood. Did you need a certain kind? Because um. I can add it on. I was just thinking just regular uh, wheat because that grows fast and will get Nice to wheat you. Uh, if, what I was originally going to do was I was going to make like a super tower of like all the different vegetables and stuff. Because all I do is on each floor, so one, uh, one harvester gets uh, 25 by 25 done. Okay. So I can make... well, server's lagging. There we go. So I can make, um, each floor I can make nine plots of seven by seven. And now all I'll do is just use crop sticks on them. So the harvester keeps pulling it off, but leaving the seeds, so and when they regrow again, it just pulls it off again. Okay. I'm kind of wondering where I would do that. I mean, I can just put a harvester on my farm and extend a, a power line to it. Because a harvest yep. will harvest all my stuff. Yep, and it's just planted. make sure you put the crop sticks on them, because otherwise, once it pulls them off, it pulls everything off. And you have to replant it. Uh, even for wheat? Yep. Oh, I thought we replanted it, so... Surplus energy, 52 billion in one, 80 billion in the other. Oh yeah, I said I ran out of lead, right? Yeah. Well, we can't have that. We can't have that. I should actually check how my reactor's doing on the uh, delorium. I'm, I think we're running out of uh, delorium. I doubt that. 
I just haven't uh, loaded my reactor in a while with it, so. Do I still have tons of it? Day tons? Yeah, well, I got my reactor turned down 98%, so. <laughs> Alright, I want making, like, nether lead ore dimlet. It's only making just uh, about uh, just under 900 per tick. ID 38 To the lead world Are you going to set up the quarry in there? Yep. Oh, did you take the barrel of uh, oil off the uh no. the tesseract? No, there's one sitting full in the corner. Okay. Because there's oil in this world, so... How much lead should I get? All of it. There's going to be a lot of lead in our future. I think that should be enough. Ender quarry, boundary established. <laughs> Need to reveal the chunk so that it doesn't fuck up the ground. That looks good. All right, so. Where did that marker go? Oh seeds and fill up the seed thingy one more time. I have to pick up the markers. Where are you at, marker? There you are.
Then this marker over here. I mean, technically, I'd be, I could be lazy fuck and just leave them here. Did I miss the marker? I'll blame it on my squinty eyes. Now, what would really make this better is if I actually had the test rack to power it. <laughs> wow. What happened? There's a tree thingy chasing me. A tree thingy? Mandragora? No, come take a look at this. I think this is part of witchery because I uh, attacking these ruined trees. <laughs> wow. It has like a ton of defense. Did you get Ooh, anything from it? It gave me an ant twig. I think it's for a bunch of things. All right, back to thirty eight. How much power does this world have left? 85,000. Alright. Go Tesseract. Go home! Or what? All right. Spare Tesseract. My harvester. But how much does a harvester do? Like how much does it use up or the range? Because default range is 3x3, three three, but if you put an emerald upgrade in it, it brings it up to 25 by 25 25. If I put that right in the center, it would do this in all, all of these squares, any? Eh? Well, it's uh, facing it, so you'd have to put it slightly like outside of it. Okay, so if I do one half and then do facing this way, yeah. Oh, so aren't you planting mandragoras? I harvested them all. I'm gonna go for power, I might as well go overboard.
nothing better than going overboard with power. Nothing much funnier than going overboard with no power. Dropping loads of M MFSU. I'm actually amazed it doesn't cause huge FPS drops. I guess the uh, industrial craft power f things work quite well. Dropping loads of EU. <laughs> Got your uh, solar panels done. No, it's going to take a long time to get solar panels done, but I'm putting up more MFSUs, so. I bet. Because if there's one thing I need, it's more energy storage. Remember, I just crafted 100 MFSUs. Nothing like an extra, what, like 4 billion EU storage? Getting them in the right spot sucks, though. Is there an auto crafter for Ingvar? Yes, there should be. Want me to turn it on? Uh, can't you turn it on from in the thingy? I just told it to make 6,000 more Invar, so... Okay, thanks. That should be enough to last for a little while. Man, that supply, eh? Yeah. All right, let's get all these new MFSUs filled up, too. Okay, so the harvester faces towards you when you put it down, right? Uh, no, I think it faces away from you. Oh, I'll see. Those ones are hooked up. These ones are looking good. Mm, 
running out of cable. Right, need more glass fiber cable. Let's make a bunch of these. It's just 64 million RF, why not? Or the EU. Getting the EU going. So I'm at 33 million for the MFSUs. For the old ones. So that means I've used like 7 million times however many I had there at the time before I put the new ones up. Jeez. All right, Malls will make a bunch of test racks because I need them. Yeah, fill up those frame. How much bronze do we have? 62k. Alright, we're good for bronze. Jeez. Alright. Making some HV cable. All right, more test racks. One, two, three, four, five. Now configure. Gonna use so much energy. I need more connectors. Mm. 
Okay, and I'll need to make an upgraded uh, item item mover too, won't I? Upgraded item mover? To pull stuff out of the harvester? Or I can detach a chest right to the harvester, can't I? Yep. Okay, that'll be... Directly easy. into the inventory. Storage is triple yellow, right? Yep. Okay, we got one sitting. Hey, we're out of hardened clay. Time to put clay into the electric furnace. Boop. Let's get some power. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, I need more glass fiber cable. Hooked it up and all of a sudden all my wheat. Nice to wheat you. <laughs> I, I powered it up without uh, putting the crop sticks on so all my wheat just disappears and that's like, oh, crud, I gotta go wheat. <laughs> and everything. <laughs> Told ya. I gotta put crop sticks down first, don't I? Yep. Alright, silver into macerator. Fifteen million blasts left. More power. Do I need to double up on the crop sticks or just one set? Just one set. Uh, double up, make some crossbreed. But they only cross onto empty cross crop, crop sticks, so since they're not empty. <laughs> 
Alright, I think I've got the power hooked up, so... I think here's a good time to call it. Yeah, I'm just going to finish uh, putting these crop sticks up, and then I was going to say the same thing. So I'm now using 150,000 RF per tick now. <laughs> And we have 89k lead, lead ore, which is like 370, they're like, well, 360,000 uh, lead ingots. I think I'll let the macerators, no, not macerators, I'll let the uh, sag mill work through it because, not nah, fucking macerator. Hang on, Macerator. You have other things to worry about first. Ferris, is that Pulverizer? Ferris we pulverizers. What other ore do we have? The alarm can be Sagmill. Actually, maybe the I'll have the master work through three different types of ores. There we go. There we go. Saying what's got you. Oh, Pulvar is already done. <laughs> Well, pulverizers, you may as well work through the iron. Okay. And we can have... High five! <laughs> All right, we're done. Take care, Thanks everybody. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a comment, like it, and share it with your friends. You can also click on the left button if you want to subscribe, and the right one to watch more Minecraft. Thanks for watching.